Awesome. Jungle Bob runs a facility for exotic reptiles and gives educational programs to children about the protection of these animals. Ooh, someone's looking mean in there. Yeah, he's quite a handful, this guy. Well, Got me a little bit. There well, we go. There's the proof. There's the proof you handle the Crocs monitor. I was happy to get out of there with just that, Bob. Yeah, Let me well, tell you. Sorry to tell you. Now we got to do it again. We got a new cage set up for him, a whole new display. Let's uh, get him into his new home. You know what we're dealing with? Yeah. A lot of teeth, a lot of claws, a lot of tail that whips, and it absolutely can go right for the eyes. So we gotta be very careful when we take him out of the box. You got some gloves? Nah, we don't need no gloves. You gonna grab him? Yeah, let's just do it. I wouldn't recommend handling a croc monitor without studded gloves. Never mind barehanded, but Jungle Bob's been doing this a long time. And he's a little nuts. Oh. Uh... He's not that bad. Hey, boy. Hey, boy. Whoa. Got him, Bob. He's not that big. Good job. Oh. He's a whipper. That's not good. That's not good. Well, the last thing we want to do is have him get those teeth onto us. Those are little tiny triangular teeth that are designed to rip flesh off of animals, so we do not want them to do that to us. Oh, jeez, there we go. Gotcha. Take them off there, take them off there. Coming up on We Move Animals, the boorish habits of nervous pigs. You don't smell that? And the spa treatments that are sure to calm them down. We start off by giving them a little Reiki. That's a healing energy. In the past 24 hours, Anthony's adventures with a croc monitor have gone anything but smoothly, and he's got the marks to prove it. He managed to make the cross-country trip with this rowdy reptile in one piece, but now it's gotten its curved claws into the client. Oh, jeez, there we go. You gotcha? Take him off there, take him off there. Ah, that's just his claws. If that was his teeth, we'd be taking a ride to the hospital. The mouth of a crocodile monitor contains bacteria, one bite can produce infection that can prove fatal if left untreated. Okay, easy does it. Right. I'm telling you, that's got to be five times the size of where he was. What a beautiful spot he's got now. This croc will now roam around in 18 by 12 foot space. He can use his claws to climb as he would in the wild, instead of clawing at clients. That's not too bad. Yeah, battle scars. Another job well done. That's it. Love brothers. <laughs> Thanks now. so much. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> brothers in arms. Yep. Now you got one more lizard to teach the kids about. There's a lot of zoos that don't have crocodile monitors, so we're extremely fortunate to have an animal like this in our possession, and I am psyched. He's going to grow like a weed because he's going to get fed regularly, and it's going to be exciting for people to see.